All right. Well, <laughs> we're like right there. Oh, good a nest. This is gonna be the first and like last one we do is miles. Oh, good. It's so long. Alright. Are they doing it again? Jeez, how many of those are they giving me? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, you come here. Oh, that was big. A lot of them seem very focused on me. Oh, no, there we go. I spoke too soon. Who wants to come here? What do you mean you don't want to? Hey! My ability calls you here. Where's that voice coming from? I can't let them get to the heart. I really hope he uh, isn't going to come over here and say hi. That could be real dangerous. Alright. We're not doing too bad. Ow. Not great, where are you? How? Alright. Oh, hey, I got an idea. That did some work. Why do I have a feeling a big guy just popped up here somewhere? Oh cool, he didn't, but it did sound like it was going to be one. Get away from the thing. No, I, I, I really don't think I should. Whoa! <laughs> See, now you're all learning why you should step back. Stop hitting the damn thing. There we go. Oh, believe me, I'm feeling it. All of you symbiotes, stop it. Um, why ain't it dead yet? Uh-oh. What the hell? Oh, this is unique. Where am I? They've never done this to me before. Mm, I'm not thinking so. Is this what happens when people turn into symbiotes? Oh yeah, I guess we have these, we can use them. Venom. We, nobody wants this. So we're gonna get you out. Is that the meteor? Oh. Please join us. Are we about to go have a symbiote Haley boss fight? Haley's in trouble. Pete. I saw the meteorite. It's under the Harlem subway station, next to the bridge. Man, they really like to screw with Harlem. Wait for me, though, man. Harry, he's after you. I have to go help Haley, but just wait, all right? Whoa, whoa, back up. What happened? I got sucked into the high pine. I saw this vision of the meteorite underground, but I've got a bad feeling. 
You think Harry's there? I'm serious, Pete. Just give me ten minutes. You cannot do this alone. Right. Call me when you're done. I'm sorry, Miles, but I can't waste any time. There's the okay, subway game. Entrance. Miles has to be right. That's where the meteorite is. Why do I feel like we're about to walk into a bridge. trap? Because you don't Everyone listen. Uh, that's right. I know you're here. Oh yes, let's antagonize the giant monster yes, symbiote that's here, been buddy. kicking our ass every time we see him. I know. Just hang on. I'm coming. Come here. Man, we're really in the end game now. They're just throwing us fight to fight. I swear, Mr. Purple Guy, I'm getting real tired of you and your friends. All right. The meteorite has to be underground. Come here. Please talk to me. I don't want to talk to him. He's weird and creepy. But I can't leave these people behind. Come here. Oh shit, that was awesome. Stupid purple. Oh god. I'm coming up there. There we go. And while you're affected, I guess I'll just come punch you. Now are we done? Oh, right. Oh. Hi there. Come here. Now, Harry! Can you hear me? Ooh, jumped right off of that. I'll find you, buddy. I'm coming. Just stay down. Good, that guy's down. Ow. Ow again. Come on, dummy, get over here. Oh. Well, shit, he was down. There, the subway tunnel. Hey, everything all good with Haley? Not yet, but you still owe me a few more minutes. Hang tight. Okay, I am playing as him. Haley, no. No, don't do it. You're gonna turn him purple. Trying to save. Yeah, he's fighting. He's been fighting a bunch of monsters. You're incredible. I, I like you so much, and I think you like me. Oh, look where he's going. You want to go out? On a date? Well, I guess there's no better time to do it. <laughs> It's a date then. After all this is over. Yeah, we should probably make sure that, you know, this is done. I really think that the one thing they could have done for this suit, at least like as an interesting thing, would be the idea to toggle up the hood. Because he's got a hood on it, but he won't wear it. And I don't know, like I really like Miles in the hood. Like, I don't know, I just like his suits with hoods, really, hey, a lot. Leave a message. Hey, buddy. I talked to Dr. Connors. He but I also think the red on, needs to be a little bit darker. True. I think with how light the blue is, the really light red doesn't, it, like, clashes instead of, like, brings it out. If they had a darker red, I think that would have been better. 
Granted, I know because some people are pointing it out, I guess this was made because it was like an Adidas thing? So I'm like, that sort of explains a lot. <laughs> but I don't know, I know a lot of people say it's an awful suit. I'm like, I think it's redeemable. I don't think it's that bad, but it's the choices they made were bad. Great. We're fighting him in the sewers. Oh, cool! <laughs> uh, I'm downstairs. Everybody come here. Yeah, we're really locking them down here. We better hope that you beat everybody, because boy would it suck to get unsymbioted and then re-symbioted again. Listen, you jackass. Okay, are we done? Oh, we're not done. Are we? I don't feel like we're all that close so far. Stop it. Ooh, that knocked some people out of it. I'm doing you all favors, alright? Stop doing this to me. Alright. <laughs> Uh, hopefully we didn't, like, web her too bad. She looks like she's having trouble breathing. Harry, talk to me. Please help us, Peter. We need you. He's being... Trying, he's being tricky. We just need that meteorite, okay? Well, he's... made a pretty big mess. So, the last time we fought him, he beat our ass. And it looks like you're letting him do it again. Harry, what are you? We are healed. Finally free. We can give that gift to everyone. I don't think that's gonna go so well, buddy. Oh my god. We can't stay here. Oh. Well, you make it look so easy. He could have came after us, but instead he growled angrily. Was his choice there. I guess we should be thankful. You good, man? We need to call MJ. Well, <laughs> MJ, we all need to meet up at May's house. What's going on out there, guys? It's the meteorite that the symbiote arrived in. He's using it to transform the city. I know where it is. And we're gonna steal it. Time to game plan. I'm in. See you guys at home. All right. Oh, there are so many symbiote around us right now. <laughs> oh, wait, symbiote. Get, get out of here. Alright, now let's see. I feel like if we do this enough, we should be able to find...
Oh, like good. I'm sure we all want to hear what this asshole has to say. Lock the doors. Board the windows. Oh my god, you're actually giving good no advice. What the hell? The city is overrun with a miasma of massive, oppressive tendrils emanating from the ground beneath our feet. Sternal, where the hell have you been? It's been like this for, like, hours. Converting us. And will soon overtake us. Don't give them the chance. While the government sits on its hands, my loyal listeners have taken to the forums, looking for any signs of the weakness. forums. Yeah, no, I'm sure that means we a lot. Defend ourselves. We know we can't count on those fighter men to save us. Yo, what are you gonna do? Dude, what are you doing right now? You gonna go out with a gun? Stay safe. Remain vigilant. We will get through this. New York does not go down without a fight. And I will be there. Right next to you. On the front line. Godspeed. And may we all see tomorrow. Alright. Well, here's the, uh... Can you not, like, visit the grave right now? Oh, uh, I wonder if you can't interact with it because we're, like, locked in a story thing. Alright, so we're gonna try and do this. One of the things you have to do is, like, fly with the web wings all the way from one area to the next. So we're gonna try that. But let's see, I don't know how well this will go. I think if we try and follow the wind tunnels, they might give us a path to uh, where we need to go. There we go. Oh shoot, that let us fly real high. So I don't know if you could web zip, unfortunately. I think you could just use the tunnels, so we kind of got to find another one. Damn it. There we go. So where is... Where's that path? There it is. Okay, so if we take this... Oh no, get in there. Okay, here we go. I think we found it. So we definitely found the path to do. I hope I started in Financial District. I'll suck if I didn't. Downtown Queens. Oh, we gotta be getting close. There we go. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, so we knocked out two trophies there. But anyway, we'll uh, I'll stop screwing around. We'll go do the final mission, and then there's just a few more trophies we'll try and wrap up. Because I figure at this point we're so close, we might as well just end it with the platinum, right? I'll have to figure out what I'm supposed to do to get that trick before landing one as well. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised they're mentioning that, considering it wouldn't let me, like, select anything or do anything there. Central Park Reservoir. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere, adding more and more people to the hive mind. If all those symbiotes get out of Manhattan... Goodbye, Earth. Hello, planet goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? That's been the case so far, yeah. But it was useless until Harry repaired it. 
Yeah. And that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it. Or free everyone connected to the hive mind. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Me. Oh, I see. Illustrative purposes. Harry's still Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without his best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. Well, I grab the space rock for illustrative purposes. <laughs> right. Fire up the accelerator. No more hive mind. World saved. We all get your rose? <laughs> Theoretically. Deep. What Connor said about Harry being too far gone. If you can't save him, are you won't ready? come to that. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. Oh well, my boy Genki, he's not in on it. Is he gonna be running point? Although I guess probably in Genki's mind, he's like, damn Miles, you're crazy to go do this. I want no part of this. So the meteorite is somewhere in that thing? So are Harry and his friends. Here. I figured you could use a sonic touch. Oh god. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. We got two Spider-Men here, but I got a feeling I know who I'm playing right now. <laughs> He's coming, isn't he? Who knows? Yeah, don't talk like you're about to die. There's still a third game. Oh, all the symbiotes are just straight up ignoring him. You gonna sit in there and play with your pet rock all night? This would be the perfect time to do an anti-venom blast. It's you and me, Harry. Harry comes. Of course, the problem is if he's connected to all this, when like. MJ and Miles go in. Our gift will finally be yours. Here's the thing, though. Oh shit! Where the hell has that been this whole fucking time, you shithead? Good thing he's really single track because they didn't really go that crazy or that far for them not to know. Wow, these things like don't give a shit right now. They have to be fucking agitated to move. MJ now. Holy shit, why are we all not using this thing? Yup, all right. <laughs> what a story, Watson. Why are you all roaring? Oh. Uh, oh, that's a big guy back there. I don't think this little thing's going to do us anything. Oh. Oh, Jesus, duh. I was like looking at these little fire spouts. I'm like, am I supposed to be hitting those? I'm like, those are kind of hard to hit. I kind of forgot that we just did a mission that basically had us do that with Miles and Peter earlier. 
You only do it once, then you don't get anything like that again. Why are Oscorp people down here? Just hang on. Yeah, like we're gonna be able to actually help him. Not up. You're safe now. Norman must have sent a team after her. This thing left more than just flares behind. Go back. Whoa, ho, ho, okay. Yeah, you guys stay over there. Ow. I was, so I learned, my first thought is I'm like, I wonder if she'll uh, do like blind fire. She does not. She will stand up. So that's good to know for the future. Blind fire is not a thing. So you guys are such wusses. When I got pulled out of the symbiote, I was fine right away. The girl with no superpowers. Very little training. Although she is like John Wick, the female ginger version. Uh oh. I can't wait for when they tell me, hey, fight a behemoth. Oh, hello, things. You want to go, too? Alright, well, that's all the green boys. I don't think I'm getting that far enough for him. How many of you? Ooh, that was a headshot. Oh wow, it's so easy. I bet all I have to do is pull it and then go. There's no way they're gonna make me leave here. Just a normal rock. Yeah. But I can also end the world. Taking a real long time. You really should just grab it and go. Well, that was something we could have tried earlier. I have a feeling they're all, like, able to sense that rock and where it is. It's not like we were necessarily doing stealth before, but it's definitely not happening now. They're gonna be all over me. You really couldn't even try and get Time that into go. your backpack the full way? Like, you could have zipped it up. Hi. Oh, I knew it. I said they were gonna sense the damn rock. Nobody's here. Oh my god. Will you- no, go back. You need to use this as cover. Stop it. Also, where's the last one? There was- oh, there he is. Am I not going that way? Alright. Oh, I guess this was to be expected. Man, how did we get to a point where this became a third person shooter? I was not prepared for this. Oh my. I think they let me do sneak attacks on them. No. <laughs> but I'm glad I tried. Ow. Actually, you guys are idiots. Oh, okay, hold on. Hold on. color are those ones that just ran? Oh, okay. They're purple.
Hang on, guys. I gotta get a little bit closer. Holy! Go away. Look, I'm saving you, alright? I cannot wait for them to throw this giant ass fucking behemoth at us. I know it's gonna happen. Right before we end it, they're gonna make me shoot one of them. Oh, see? What did I say? Oh! Oh. I knew it was gonna happen. Ow. This in game, I am sprinting, trust me. I think that hurt it. Get hit by those. Oh no, we're playing Ring Around the Rosie. Mm-mm. Ow! Oh, hey, look at this. No! How do you know where I am? Come here. The wrong way, you jackass. Let's get the hell out of here. I got a feeling that guy's gonna be a real pain in the ass when they do the new game plus ultimate shit. <laughs> he's gonna be triple the amount of canisters, and he's probably only gonna, like, one hit, he's gonna take you down. He was that far behind you, you dumbass. Work for Oscorp. Oh, welcome to Feast. Oh, they had a fee shelter here? Wait, why did they have a feast shelter in the school? Unless this was like a career fair. And they had feast stuff there. What are you doing? This place looks so nice before you came here. Bro. Jesus. You're ruining the place. Please remember everything we've been through. You know what? I can hit you with those and I'm going to. Oh, he does not take a lot of damage. <laughs> Yeah. But we had each other. What, what the? Gotta stay off the ground. Oh, hey, it's just like uh, Doc Ock a little bit. Doesn't seriously just want me to stay here the whole time, does it? Now you tell me. Come here. Got you. Don't hurry. Harry. You know, for how big he looks in the cutscenes, he actually doesn't look that bad here. I feel like I can take this. Alright, alright. Come here. Fear, 
was asking for that one. Are you doing the thing that you did before? Come here. What are you talking about? Listen, that was his fault. This big black goo monster on you, he made me forget. Yeah, I mean, we did. Ow, stop it. I want you to come over here. See, look at this thing. Come here. Both those look fun. Oh god, he didn't care. Ow. Yeah, you're not the only one that has cool abilities. You want to join us? Not really. Damn it, Pete. Do you know how much fucking shit we had to go through to stop this the first... Okay, good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who said you could bring friends? Hey. Oh, you jackass. There you go. See, you're free now. You're welcome. Am I supposed to be mashing a button? No? Okay. Come here. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm sure you do. Damn it, I missed him. I don't know why I thought that would work. Oh, I used the wrong thing. We're just gonna do that real quick. No, no, no. Be nice to the boy. Stop doing that, man. You're ruining the playing field. You actually really ruined the playing field. Stop doing that. Come here. Wow. No, no, no. You get hit with that. Uh oh. Come here. Well, have you looked at yourself? Ow! Ow. Yeah, come here. Your friends are bad influences. Uh oh. Better friends. Now, this is gonna hurt a little bit, but I'm helping, I promise. There you go. See, hey, come here. Let feet help. You got him. Pete, this is the second time you let him get you with the same stupid, weird, like, symbiote leg move. Oh, he didn't seem to like that this time. Doesn't matter what you do to me. I'm never gonna heal the world with you. 
Jesus, it took you a real long time to know about that. Um. Oh. Okay, so I guess we'll continue it over here that I was gonna say I'm like there was two more things on him yeah we'll get over it giant flappy venom monster <laughs> Jesus Christ yeah you might want to pay a bit more oh we're gonna move him into here okay Are we oh, okay? I was like, I can't tell if we're trying to like jump into him or if we're trying to pull it down on him. We were pulling it down. He's okay, right? Let's just get him out of here. Yeah, I got a feeling we're gonna have to go deal with that. Miles is like, do I have to? It's like every time he comes for Pete, he kicks his ass. Now you want me to go do this? Hey! Come here. Wow, you actually really got your ass handed to you there. I don't have to know you don't want to help you. It would probably help more to have known that you weren't such a fucking dickhead. Wait, it says we only got... Two, I thought we had, like, three more things to go with him. Did I, like, miss one? Did I take down two health bars with him? Or was there only ever four? I thought there was five when we started this fight. Because I thought there was four beads and then a health bar. Maybe I was wrong. Stop. Stop. Ow. Okay, that didn't work. Stop it. You're being bad. Hey. There we go. Holy shit, that did a lot of damage. What the hell? Oh no, you missed. Whatever will you do? Hey, we got rid of him. Also, we keep seeming to throw him where we need him not to be. Peter doesn't need you anymore. Now would be a good time for Peter to wake up. He has us now. Pete, you better wake the fuck up, dude. <laughs> Oh, you. Okay, at least Miles is fucking getting his shit together. You see what's behind us right now? You're not gonna like what I'm gonna do with it the second this starts. Oh, there's one in front of us, too. 
Alright, Venom, watch this. Damn you! Hey! You broke it, that that should have gone off! Um... There we go. Oh shit. I didn't realize that was what I grabbed. You took him away from us. Took him away. What the hell are you talking about? Come here. Oh Jesus. In the forest. We remember what you did. Harry, man, that's the symbiote talking, not you. Wait, in the forest? Oh. With Craven. Yeah, you weren't there. This is clearly the symbiote talking now, and you need to stop listening to him. He's dumb. Yes. Oh my god, I used the wrong button. Ah. God, don't miss the chance. Aha. I got a feeling he's gonna hit me with something. Yeah, he didn't seem too happy about what was happening there. Oh my god! I feel like you want to stop doing that. There we go! Now, it's time for you to stop being a jerk. God, every time they go to hit him, he's just like... Hey, that's not your rock. Is he about to smash my face in with this? Oh shit! Harry. Oh, he's leaving. All right, Venom, you can't, you can't leave yet, buddy. Are we about to do like the freaking web wing shit? Aw, oh, god damn it. I finally thought I was gonna get some help. Put the rock down. It's not yours. Did we destroy his wings? Oh, you do not. Oh! <laughs> hey, he's back up! Alright, we're gonna pull down the helicopter. Is that what's going on? Oh god. Oh, okay, there we there's a team up. Oh good, they made it inside. No, we can't go inside there.
Bro! Oh shit, it's the church. All I'm saying is there's a, probably a bell up there. Oh no. Oh, he's going right for the bell for us. Let's do it. Oh, maybe there's not a bell in that church. Put the wings away. Stay here and fight. Oh god. Oh, let's just hold it full. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Gotta get this thing going. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together. Oh, he's back. Do we have any other sound things? You dipshit. Are you fucking unconscious again? MJ, you better, like, shoot him. Get him in the head. Yeah, I was thinking shoot him, but sure, shoot the rock, too. We're in business. Oh. I kind of thought, I mean, I know he only had the one thing left, but I was really expecting they'd go a route there where, uh, we'd fight him one last time. Like when we were crash landing or even just outside. That was a really, like, long, sort of quick time event cutscene that I feel they could have done gameplay around like especially considering what they did with Doc Ock on the side of the building like that was sort of like a cinematic fight but I feel like they could have done something similar here and I think it would have been a lot more enjoyable than just kind of watching them fight and at three different occasions being told mash a button or hold this button <laughs> Harry saw the bright white light at the end. That is gonna be one hell of a fucking headache to wake up to. <laughs> like, what the shit? Is it dying? Oh, it is gone gone now. Of course, I guess I kept my symbiote. <laughs> well, I guess it wouldn't have the- we know it doesn't have the weakness to sound. So I guess the ant- well, also whatever Cletus Casty has, I guess Carnage will be a thing. But outside of that, Anti-Venom's like the one standing symbiote. How does the anti-venom stuff work with Pete? Could he transfer it to Harry? 
Or is it like locked to him? Give me some room. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try. For the life. <laughs> He's awake for like a second. That's the second time. That is not what he wanted to see coming here. So if MJ's standing there with him, shouldn't really be that hard for Norman to piece together who that is. There are traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive. See, I could get why they wouldn't want, but a part of me was thinking, like, can't he use the anti-venom stuff? He got him a new cane. God, what does your family have against that window, man? G-Serum ready. ASAP. Well, <laughs> I think we know what's happening to him. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But I hope they don't try and do it to Harry, though, because... I mean, they already made him venom, making him like a goblin too. God, that would suck. We are tired. Just have Norman use the serum stressed, and go crazy. Numb. But we have never lost hope. I do wonder if the third game could go a route where maybe Pete learns to transfer the anti-venom symbiote. Because I mean, if Harry's already venom, maybe he could become anti-venom, like the actual anti-venom, and not just the suit that Pete got. It could be an interesting way for them to kind of bring back, like, Venom gameplay for the third game. Maybe make Venom playable as anti-Venom in, like, the third act. In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city. Exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Well, I guess we have a new podcast that's going to be going on. Which will save us from Jonah's podcast. 
Now who am I kidding? I'm sure he's still gonna be going. Episode one, done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Are these good to go? In a minute. I wanna show you something first. Okay. It has molasses in it. Oh. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> Oh, uh, got a feeling they gotta move out. Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Oh, is it not? Is it? That would have been a perfect time if they could have gotten Gloria in. I don't think they were. I don't. I don't know if it was like the actress or something, but I don't think she made it into this game. Sadly. Hopefully she'll show up again in the future. I liked her character. Thought it was a cool way for her to start as just a random civilian. Ah, uh, so this is where the last one was. I was saying, I'm like, they have one that's missing. Not done yet. Of course. <laughs> Talk to Maya and Isabella? Not yet. Go! Oh. <laughs> you ready? Uh, Miles. I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about some. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you all, all the time. It's, it's, it's great uh, to talk. So many good talks. <laughs> it's just. I haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Miles, you really gotta learn to wear your mask you more outside. Know. They're already suspicious. Are you, are you sure it's... Spider-Man and a mutant city. woman were fighting, screaming at each other. Now we have you over and you're in a suit talking to me. I think people kind of know. Now all the Queens knows who Spider-Men are too. Maybe not now, but there'll come a time. I'm here for you. Always. Yeah, when Green Goblin shows up and starts causing shit. I'll be back. <laughs> It would be kind of cool with the third game, like, for that opening intro. Because every single time we've played as Miles, like, in the intro, he's always with Pete. It'd be kind of cool if it's Miles alone dealing with the intro villain. It would also be kind of cool if they introduced Peter in the third game as, like, the first time you play as him, he's just doing a normal job. Very different than I think people would expect. But anyway, that's it for the story. If you stick around for a few extra minutes, like I said, we were going to get those last few trophies. So what we'll do is we'll kind of run around and do that. But before we meet back up, I do know there are a few end credit cutscenes, which I think are supposed to kind of hint at some stuff for the third game. So uh, we'll check those out. What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son.
We all have to experience loss. Even you, Norman. What are you writing? Hi. Uh, hope you're hungry. The food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? You worked so hard on it. Some guy in Harlem, probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Haley, this is Albert. Uh, hi, nice to meet you. Oh, and uh, <laughs> this is my daughter, Cindy. Well, all right. So that kind of left us some interesting things there. So I have heard that Cindy is believed to be, or may even have been confirmed already, to be. Wait a second. Start fresh with wait, ultimate difficulty's already out. What's up, New York? Alright, so I really have no clue. Uh, my initial thought was that New Game Plus wasn't in the game, probably due to the fact that they weren't done like working on some of the difficulty changes for Ultimate. And that was like my one like thing I was kinda giving them is I'm like, you know, that could take some time. Maybe that's why New Game Plus isn't here yet. They wanted to do it at the same time. Still thought it was kind of bullshit, but I'm like, whatever. But the fact they have Ultimate out but don't have New Game Plus is bizarre to me then. I really have no idea why that wasn't done at launch. It, I cannot fathom why that's, that, that's what it is. But you know, whatever. It's, it is what it is. <laughs> it's just... Uh, I got a full review of this game. I guess I shouldn't really call it a review. It's more of just my thoughts and opinions on everything. Where I'm going to go a little bit into that. Uh, but yeah, I definitely... I had some overall thoughts about things leading out of that, so we'll kind of look into that. But anyway, let's check and see. So we should have a few trophies left that we got to hit. Uh, so let me see. Purchase all available suits, which we should be close to. All the MF stuff, which we should be close to. The air tricks, I have to figure that one out. Is that? Okay. So these should be pretty quick and easy to do. So first off, I think his trophy... Unless I'm wrong, which I could be, it should be he left it at the church at the end of Miles Morales. So we just got to find the right church, and we should be able to figure it out. 
think the church was roughly in this area. So we'll kind of swing around and see if we can find it. Can you tell us more about it? Happy to. I've been thinking a lot about what's really important. I really do think I think if the red was a little bit darker and if the hood was up, I think this would be an all right suit. On the flip side, they could keep the same red and maybe make the blue a little bit I don't know if darker is the right word, but more of like a translucent. Like I know they're going for like the evolved lightning effect. I can tell that's what they were going for. It's just I feel like the colors don't go together while they like clash. This church. Stay safe out there. Oh, and if you have motorcycle insurance, make sure it includes a villain damage clause. I could oh. be painting your voice there. I'm working through it. I didn't realize that MJ was on her thing with her. <laughs> Let me see. I would have thought it was at this. I thought it was this church. Maybe it was a different one. Please stop it. Because I thought it was at the church that they... Because they, like, came to the church. I thought this was the one. Am I wrong? Maybe I am wrong. Was it on this... For some reason, I feel like it was on this side of the map. Hang on. Oh, it's you guys. For some reason, I wasn't expecting more symbiotes. Yeah. They're very beautiful eyes. Compliment them. Are you still hitting one? Where are you? I actually, I really thought that they were going to get rid of the symbiote. I didn't think we'd be able to hit them anymore. Just try to stay off the street. It's not safe out here. All right, so let's I think we're going the right way. It's somewhere in this lower area. It's there's one I think on the left side of the map. There might be one at the bottom. I know he left it at a church. I remember that much. I can't remember what the church was. I know it's called the Trinity Church. So, I don't know, if he mentions Trinity Church at any point, we'll know we're, we'll know we're like, where we need to be. Am I going, I'm not going up, am I? No, I'm not. What I should do is find a way to get to a really high spot on the map as well. Because I'll need that if we're going to, uh get that 30 air tricks or whatever because I don't know if they can be interrupted or not like if you can swing and go again if it's just before you land or what they want it's not a church back there is it I don't think it is where's the church Oh, hey. Is this it? Maybe, did they meet? Because I don't... I feel like this isn't the church they got attacked at, though. I thought that one did have, like, a dual side. Maybe he left it in a different... Doing my best, Finn. Trying to make a city we both be proud of. There we go. You got a package here at the house. Okay. I put it in the garage for you. It's from Norman Osborn. Oh, interesting. That's Thanks for letting me know. Slightly concerning. Did he send a bomb to the house? Break time zone. Okay. So alright, we gotta go north now. <laughs> but anyway, I guess I think everything else we have to do can be finished as Pete and pretty much needs him, so we'll probably be ending our time with him. What a way to end out our series. So yeah, it's um 
So like I said, I've heard that Cindy Moon. I can't remember if it was just people anticipating it or if it was confirmed by Insomniac. But there's a possibility that they might include Silk into the next game too, which could be interesting to see. It would make me curious to see how many people they'd make playable, because like I'd love to see them do something with like anti-venom for Harry to bring him back that way. I feel like it could also be a cool way to just kind of round things out where like Harry plays a part in beating Norman in the next game. Can you smell the but I just uh it's fresh. I don't know what they'll do. Silk doesn't seem to get a lot of mainstream attention though, so it would be nice for her to uh get a role in this game kind of add to her in the same way that like Miles and Spider Gwen are getting seen a lot more in a lot of those other characters. New York stood tall. All right, I'll take it from here. Who wants to fight right now? You know what? I was going to skip right on by, but then you guys antagonized me and so I decided against it. Oh, hey, race back. Um, okay. Oh, hey, it's my hunter friend. Guy, you did not want to do that. Yeah, so that was the one thing that I've heard that I knew I was going to be upset about, is that I've been told by people that he unfortunately, like, loses the spider arm things so every parry that's done now is done with his anti-venom symbiote you want to get some coffee no why why can't we be friends but yeah that's like if there's one thing i really hope that they add in this game there was just an update let me see is this wishful thinking did they do it maybe yeah it doesn't look like there's anything yet but my thought is, I'm like, the one thing I would like to see them do customization-wise is, A, I'd like to see them let you change the symbiote color, because I know it's white now and it stays white regardless of the suit. I would also really like to see them go the route where, if you want to build your Spidey with the spider arms and not use the anti-venom powers, that you could parry with the spider arms still. It's sort of uh, upsetting that you lose that ability afterwards. But yeah, so the other thing, which is probably the bigger implication, is the Norman and Otto scene. And so, I don't know what to take, because a part of me wonders if, like, we're looking at a team-up between the two of them. Like, if Otto kind of sees this as, oh, you suffered like I had, so we'll work together now. Because clearly Otto has plans, and he's definitely going to play a role in the next game. But, like, the other part of me kind of sees it as it would be perfect for him to, uh sort of try and play, I don't know if I would say both sides, but basically become a side of his own. Where, like, it's gonna essentially end up being the Spider-Man versus Green Goblin and his group versus Doc Ock and his group. Oh. Hell of a son you raised, Jeff. I nice you didn't stop back here for that. Alright, now where was... Is this where May and Ben were? Parker Lux, back with a vengeance. Alright, well there was that. And so... Let me see, because my thought is, I'm like, maybe it is just... Roll, don't hit the ground. And so we'll just kind of try and get things out. I'm not going for that car. I'm in the middle of shit. Didn't know New York had a drift scene. Is it also different unique tricks, I wonder? It's fine, we're not even focusing on it. I can't tell if they want it to be unique tricks too, if like I should be doing one, swinging, then doing one. 
I really pick the location too in an area where he may not catch a building fast enough. Oh, we just got a times four there. There we go. Alright, that was what they wanted. Cool. So let me see. We got only a few left. Purchase all suits, do the ammo. Okay. So let's head over to Queens. Because we're going to want to pick that up. And that should be it then. That'll be all the trophies. Until DLC comes out if they do any. Which I don't know if they're going to. So that's the other thing. Now, granted, the first game I said I was going to do the DLC for it. And then I never did it in videos. Because I think... I was like, oh, you know what? I'm just going to wait till all of them come out because it's a three-parter. And that was what I was going to do. That was my plan. And then I missed that the Silver Lining DLC come, came out and didn't pay attention to that. Somehow, like, completely missed that. And uh, I think I saw, like, clips from it on Facebook. I'm like, oh, it came out. I'm like, man, it took a while. And then I realized, like, oh, that came out seven months ago. I'm like, I just completely missed that it happened. And so at that point, I just kind of decided, I'm like, eh, I don't know if I'll just play it on my own at some point. I won't bother with a video. So this time, I'll try and do better with that. If they do put DLC out, our intention will actually be to play the DLC together. Uh, but yeah, no, I will. If they do do DLC, we will do that. But I don't know if they will. Unlike the first game, they did not say that was a part of it. And so if they decided they're not doing DLC for this What's game, this? or at least not story DLC. This might be it. Plants in a thumb drive? They say you should never plug in a drive of unknown origin. But I'm no Norman, I think. Damn it, I was about to put... I wanted to see what his note said. Is he going to ask me to help him build his goblin glider? Is he giving me the bee drones? Oh, so he la oh wow. I went to see what I could recover before it got boarded up. In the box, you'll find a piece of bark from my mom's tree. And one of May's blossoms. And I thought, if you splice them together, you might get a hardy enough plant to produce seeds. Oh. Well, okay. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's why I'm like, you know what? They got to be going for some sort of story thing here. And I'm glad that was the case. All right. So I ended up looking this absolute horse shit up because this was fucking ridiculous and annoying. Uh, so, so that everyone can see it, I'm going to leave it here for a second so that you can kind of gather it. This last one is the last piece. Stick that in. Grab a screenshot. Do what you got to do because that was fucking stupid. <laughs> Well, we got it going, and when you finally get ready, and you're back, you'll see it. Hopefully we'll have more than a garage by that time. Um... I'm an astronaut! And I believe... 
we go down to oh all right. and there we go that is the uh, final trophy so we beat the game here we did a little bit of running around for the final thing and like I said this is pretty much it our videos here are done I appreciate you guys hanging out with me the past two weeks as we finish this game up and uh, yeah we'll be going back to kind of normal sporadic videos as we were doing before occasionally where I'll run through six seven hours of a game and edit it together into 20 30 minute thing that'll pretty much be the channel going forward from here on out and there will probably be a lot less videos too just because I got other stuff that's gonna be starting up again but anyway I think I think the next time we do a giant long playthrough like this, I'm kind of planning to just do this with every Insomniac superhero game at this point. So, uh, I heard rumors right now that they're expecting Wolverine to drop around this time next year. So if that actually drops in Fall of 24, we'll explore that whole game together too. But otherwise, uh, I got the review that should come out in a few days from now, and uh, once that's done, I'll see you when I see you, I guess.